All right, folks, it looks like we have another winner. Okay, so uh, I got the name of the guy that won, and uh, he decided he wanted to write a review of the answer of the last week's question. Now, last week's question was all about what is this crappy movie that I watched with my girlfriend. It was on Netflix. I gave a bunch of hints, and the name of the crappy movie was Irish Wish. This is a movie that had... Uh, Lindsay Lohan in it it was a very bad movie and it was very surprising that someone got this answer within two guesses someone guessed it and the first guess was really close it was this Christmas movie she was in I actually saw that movie too but uh, this movie must be really bad if it was that easy to guess so our winner his name is Littlehorn 1994. That's what his name is in the email. And uh, we're going to read the review that he wrote for it. And uh, I'm just going to read it off my computer. Irish Wish is a 2024 fantasy romantic comedy that's neither comedic, romantic, nor fantastic. Irish Wish, more like I wish I had given... This the Irish goodbye and exited after a few minutes. Using a classic will they or won't they plot by the end or minute 30, we're all left wondering will they or won't they hire Lohan again. This is film two of three in the lohan sandwiched between Falling for Christmas and Our Little Secret. Let's hope Netflix keeps the rest of the secrets hidden for all of our sakes. Unlike the McConaughey's, I'm afraid Irish Wish is a harbinger for the Lohanian Dark Ages. Well, that's a pretty good review. I think that he's talking about the McConaughey's. I think like Matthew McConaughey or something. So I, apparently there are two Christmas movies with Lindsay Lohan in them. That was a terrible movie. Okay, so of course... As usual, I still feel bad for all the people that didn't win. And so uh, this week we're going we're gonna to have another contest. It's just going to be for one pedal. My sales have been a little bit slow. And uh, this week's contest, I want you to, to guess what my celebrity crush is. Okay, now I don't really much have a celebrity crush anymore, but this is the, the uh, I'll give you a hint. It's a girl, okay? It's a girl or woman. And uh, this is my celebrity crush. And I'll give you one more hint. She's an actress. This is my celebrity crush. It's not my favorite actress, but it was my celebrity crush. Now, uh, so just think of like all the celebrity actresses that a guy like me might have a crush on. That's all you got to do. Whatever some loser guy like me probably watched a lot of bad movies just because this particular actress was in it. It's not Lindsay Lohan. So that's another hint. But uh, if you can guess my celebrity crush this week, I don't much have a crush on her no more. But you know, when you're a young guy, you know, you you have your little secret celebrity crushes. Like you think you're going to be a rock star or something. You're going to be dating these actresses and stuff. Uh, you know, so you got to guess my celebrity crush. And, and, and she's an actress and it's a lady. Okay, that, those are the only hints. I might have given too many hints last week. So everybody gets a guess a day. Okay, everybody gets one guess a day. And the way I've set this up is that you can you can give you can have as many guesses, but it's just one guess a day, and you can guess whoever. So if, if you just keep being consistent, you will probably find the correct answer. She's not my favorite actress, but she's my my celebrity crush. And, uh, you know, in the meantime, it, uh, if you really want to pedal, uh, I still have plenty of, of pedals for sale. Sales have been a little bit slow last week. But I just want to give some, uh, some other, uh, let's see, I just want to state some stuff. Now, on Reverb, I also have my pedals for sale, okay? And I also have my pedals for sale on Sweetwater. Now, I actually make more money if I if uh, people buy them off of the Sweetwater because I use this reverb bump thing and it takes extra fees out. So if you have a if, if it makes a difference to you, 
I, uh, you know, I prefer if you buy it off Sweetwater. But on Reverb, you can do offers. And I try to price my pedals cheap. But if you want to give offers, I'm totally down with that. And keep in mind that let's say you want $10 off a pedal. I might not take $10 off a pedal on one pedal. But if you're interested in two pedals, I will come down on the price pretty low because I can ship them in the same box, especially if they're the smaller pedals. So if, uh, you know, you might think, oh, you know, I shouldn't lowball this guy. But but uh, if, you, if you're interested in two pedals, I'll go pretty low. Pretty, pretty low on the price because I got to pay for the shipping because I'm offering free shipping on these pedals. So, uh, you know, so just keep that in mind. But for next week, I want someone to guess my celebrity crush, okay? And she's an actress. That's the only hint I'm going to give this week, okay? And that's for one pedal. And I just want more guesses, more guesses, okay? And uh, I hope everyone has a good week and everybody keeps rocking out. And uh, make sure you take a look at, what, at the pedals I got for sale because I put some new ones up there. You know, I'm surprised they haven't sold. And uh, I guess in the, uh, I guess I'll see you next week. All right, all right. Take care. Bye bye.